Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel, Regular Learning Academy. I am Dr. Krishna Sarkar, Department of Electrical Engineering. Here in this session, I will be going to discuss about state space analysis example four by using direct decomposition technique. Lecture series on state space analysis. This is lecture number 13. So our topics, state space analysis, Example four. Example four. Obtain the state space equations along with state diagram and signal flow graph of the nth order differential equation or nth order equation. This is the nth order differential equation. Dn y of t by dtn plus a1 dn minus 1 y of t by d a t n minus 1 plus a2 d to the power n minus 2 y of t by d t to the power n minus 2 plus dot 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 n a n minus 2 d2 y of t by dt2 plus a n minus 1 d of y t by dt plus a n y of t equals to u of t. This is the nth order differential, differential equation where u of t equals to input signal or reference input signal. This reference input signal may be step, ramp, impulse, parabolic, sinusoidal, or any type of input you can apply. And y of t equals to reference output or system output, where y of t equals to position. Because when rate of change of y of t, that means dy t by dt, this is velocity and d2 y t by dt2 equals to acceleration. So output always variable. That means position to velocity, velocity to acceleration, acceleration to higher order. So y of t equals to first state variable, d y t by dt equals to second state variable, d2 y t by dt2 equals to third state variable, dot, 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 the n d to the power n y of t by d to the power n another state variable. So solution, the given equation can be written as, again, this equation actually number one. This is the equation number one. And put in equation one, y of t equals to state variable x1. So taking the state variables, that means y of t equals to what? y of t equals to x1, x1, y of t equals to x1. Then differentiating both sides in equation one. That means y of t equals to x1, differentiating both sides, then d of y t by dt2 equals to y dot t equals to x1, dot equals to x2. Again, differentiate both sides, d2 y t by dt2, second time, then y double dot t equals to x1 double dot equals to x2 dot equals to x3. Again, differentiate both sides and we get d3 y of t by dt3 equals to y triple dot t equals to x1 triple dot equals to x2 dot equals to x3 dot equals to x4. And y t to, to the power n minus one dot, this is y, to, y t to the power n minus one dot equals to d n minus one y of t by d t to the power n minus one equals to x one to the power n minus one dot 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 equals to x n. Again, y to the power n dot equals to d n y of t by d t n equals to x one to the power n dot equals to dot 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 x n dot. So this is equivalent to x n dot and y of t equals to x1 state variable, dy t by dt, dy t by dt equals to x2, d2 y t by dt2 equals to x3, dt3 by dt3 equals to x sub 4, put in equation one, and we get substituting the values obtained in equation one, we get xn dot, this is equivalent to xn dot, and a1 constant, this is equivalent to x1, xn, and a2, this is a2, and this is a n minus one. This is n minus one, and dot, 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 
this is equals to x1 y t equals to x1 so a n equals a n into x1 this is equivalent to a n minus 1 into x2 this is equivalent to a n minus 2 into x3 dot 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 x n dot this is x n dot so left hand side only x n dot and others term right hand side because this type of equation or this type of form is called state equation state equation left hand side differentiation terms and right hand side free of differentiation terms so x n dot equals to minus a n x1 minus a n minus 1 x2 minus a n minus 2 x3 minus dot 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 minus a n x minus 1 minus a 1 x n equal plus u of t this is the n x n dot this is the x n dot and again the state space equations can be represented as follows this is step number three what is the state space equation x1 dot equals to what x1 dot equals to x2 only this is x2 and others coefficient zero so x2 dot equals to x3 so x3 only one coefficient and other coefficient zero x3 dot equals to what x4 only x4 and others coefficient zero similarly dot 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 xn dot equals to minus a n x1 minus a n minus 1 x2 minus a n minus 2 x3 dot 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 minus a2 x n minus 1 minus a n x n plus u of t this is these are all state equations so construct the states matrix what is the state matrix left hand side x1 dot x2 dot x3 dot x4 dot so write down x1 dot x2 dot x3 dot x4 dot then coefficient 0 1 0 0 0 dot 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 0 0 these are all first x1 dot coefficient similarly x2 dot coefficient 0 0 1 0 0 dot 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 0 0 and dot 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 xn dot minus a n2 a1 minus a1 minus a n minus 1 minus a n minus 2 dot 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 minus a4 a3 a2 a1 and x1 x2 x3 x4 dot 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 xn and u coefficient ut coefficient 0 0 0 0 dot 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 xn 0 0 0 0 and sorry 1 into u of t so the state space matrix can be represented or can be write as this form a is a constant system matrix of order n cross n b is the input coupling matrix of order n cross r and u is the a r cross one input matrix or x dot equals to x plus b is called the state equation because x dot right hand side derivative terms and free of derivative terms left hand side again y equals to cx plus du this is output equation and this output equivalent to y equals to cx plus du where y is the m cross 1 output vector c is the m cross n system matrix and d is the m cross r transmission parameter or transmission matrix and y equals to cx plus d u is called the output equation here m equals to 1 here the output equation is y of t equals to x1 because first variable y t equals to x1 so overall or final output y of t equals to what 1 0 0 0 0 dot 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 0 0 0 0 x1 x2 x3 x4 dot 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 x n only x1 coefficient 1 and others coefficient 0 because y of t equals to x1 then draw block diagram for any other system for any other system n number n number summing point and n number integration so first feedback minus a1 second feedback minus a2 third feedback minus a3 a4 a5 dot 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 a n minus one and last and final feedback a n and summation and we get x n dot x n dot and integrate x n dot then x n minus one dot and x n minus one dot equals to x n x n minus one dot integrate x n minus 2 integrate 2 dot x n minus 2 dot equals to x n minus 
one dot 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 x one integration x one dot x one dot integrate x one and x one equals to final output y of t. So this is the block diagram for nth order differential equation and the signal flow graph same for nth order system n number nodes or m number summing point and n number integration 1 by s 1 by s 1 by s 1 by s dot 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 1 by s first feedback minus 1 second feedback minus a2 third feedback minus a3 fourth feedback minus a4 finally last feedback dot 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 minus n feedback so ut is the reference input and output equals to y of t this is the signal flow graph signal flow graph for the linear system model thank you